Guests, welcome to today's Big Brother 14 update and spoiler. Our house guest of the day is TD Jesse Fan. Yay! So nominations were last night, and Frank and Will are on the block thanks to Danielle. So it looks like Brittany, Dan, and Janelle could be forming a coaches alliance and take out the newbies. So they want to keep Boogie in the house right now, even though he's being really uncooperative. But they know that the numbers are against them, so they kind of need him. And Dan is trying to convince him to join. He wants him to sit at the welcome table. If anyone can tell me what that's from, you're amazing. So Boogie is like, mm, maybe, I don't know, I'm really mad at you. And he's like, I want Frank to join the Alliance too. He is really attached to Frank. It's kind of weird. I think Boogie is trying to make Frank his Dr. Will of this season, but Frank pales in comparison to Dr. Will. He is not Dr. Will. And Boogie is just looking for someone who's going to carry him through this game. It's kind of sad. And he's got this whole coaches alliance begging him to join in. So the coaches, Dan and Brittany, who were going to align with, make an alliance with, okay, this alliance was supposed to be Dan, Brittany, Shane, Danielle, and Ian. They're having some doubts about Ian because Dan caught him in an anti-coach meeting with Will, Joe, and Jen. That's not good. So Boogie met up with Danielle in the HOH today and he was basically like, sorry I didn't come to talk to you sooner, but I was really angry. And then he was like, I want to work with you. Right. I'm sorry, but I really hope Danielle doesn't fall for this because it's so obvious that he hates her and he's definitely going to target her soon. So, Janelle is freaking out also about Joe because she knows that he's, he was at the anti-coach meeting as well, and she talks to him about it. She's like, um, so I hear you're going after the coaches, Brittany told me, and he's like, that's a lie. So, <laughs> my Joe impression's not really on tonight, but he said it's a lie. Come on, how can you deny it? Joe is like one of the ringleaders against the coaches. It's ridiculous. So the power of veto competition was today, and the players were Danielle, Frank, Will, Shane, Jen, and Ian, and Dan was the host. So in a crazy, surprising turn of events, Danielle won the POV. What? So she's two for two this week. And aside from the POV, there were a lot of other delicious prizes. So Jen won a trip. Shane won a veto ticket, which means that he can compete in the veto next week, even if he's not a nominee or pick to play. And Will, I think, won some sort of cash prize. I'm not sure on that one. And then there were, some also, there were also some punishments. So Frank has to wear some sort of unitard. That's really going to be fun, considering he loves deodorant. Not. He doesn't wear it. And Ian has to eat and drink out of a dog dish. I think that's one of my favorite punishments on Big Brother to date. So I'm really excited to see how that plays out. And I'm, I'm sure Ian's going to be a good sport about it, because I think Jen was actually going to have that punishment, but he gave her the trip instead because Boogie gave him the $3,000 and Jen the $1,000 in the coaches competition last week. So that was really nice of Ian. He's kind of weird sometimes, but I think he's a good person deep down. So good for you, Ian. <laughs> and that's pretty much all I have for you guys today. Tune in tomorrow. We'll see what happens. See if Boogie does any more ass kissing. And yeah. POV ceremony will probably be Monday, and Mom will be covering that, so we look forward to seeing what she has to say. And until next time, much love.